Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video for our daily dose of the new Bing with the chatbot ChatGPT. So if you are interested and are following uh, the developments regarding the new Bing, then as I did post yesterday, just to do a quick update, that um, the chat limit per day has been increased from 120 to 150 chats per day and we also now have 15 chat turns per session. Now, as posted last week, before we move on to today's video, um, Microsoft said they would be launching Chat GPT-4 next week, which now takes us into this week. And as many of you may know, um, the new Bing's AR Chat GPT is currently based on GPT-3.5. Now, GPT-4, as I mentioned in that video last week, which I'll leave a link to in the description, is more powerful than 3.5 with Microsoft saying, and I'm quoting this, it will offer completely different possibilities and that's like helping you to create videos and more. Now, I'm moving on to today's video and the latest now is that um, Microsoft has recently confirmed over on Twitter that uh, it's being chat, chatbot AR is now running on GPT-4 as they did mention last week. And um, that's the version of ChatGPT developed by OpenAR, which is now on version and mode model GPT-4. With Microsoft saying in a recent tweet, and once again, I'm quoting this, we're happy to confirm the new Bing is running on GPT-4, which we've customized for search. Now, interestingly enough, um, all they say in that recent tweet um, is that it has been customized for search. And it doesn't seem at this stage that any of those improvements that I did mention last week have actually been carried over into the new GPT-4. So that could be something that will roll out in the future. So at this stage, um, as we can see, if I scroll down here, um, there is no image support. Um, it gives me this answer when I'm asking for an image or anything to do with an image. And it just takes me back to the Bing.com images. And that was one of the things. Um, it would uh, have video image and data support. But nonetheless, that isn't available as yet. And also, um, as mentioned um, last week, GPT-4 um, should have quicker responses. So if I just type in hi, we can see it still takes a, a second or two. So obviously, um, the faster responses haven't rolled out yet. And Microsoft has also tweeted recently, though, that um, this is on the way. So it could be going live very soon, if not this week. Next week, where with GPT-4, we will get faster re responses when we are asking the chatbot a question. And then just a final update for today's video. Um, one of the, um, the major new additions with GPT-4, as mentioned, is basically the ability to um, accept images and process images in addition to text as an input method. And now the um, AR, the artificial intelligence, um, when that does roll out, we'll basically be able to analyze images and output answers via text. So at this stage, that isn't available, but just wanted to keep you up to date that Microsoft has confirmed that although um, all those improvements that I did mention last week haven't rolled out, um, GPT-4 has indeed made its way to the new Bing and has been upgraded from GPT-3.5 to GPT-4, with obviously those improvements rolling out over the next coming days and or weeks. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.